The game's future stars are on display as minor league baseball comes your way on the show. A Memorial Day get-together for you here at the ballpark between the El Paso Chihuahuas and the Fresno Grizzlies. Now in the box, C.J. Abrams. He will lead this one off today. towards the dugout but this one will get into the stands here now the 2-2 it's hot but not too hot this afternoon and this goes right through him and how about that to start a game the second base into the box now Bravik Valera and that's high and off the plate two and one Here's a big swing and a miss on the fastball. Two and two. Run, run, and going. there he goes towards second. In the dirt here. And forget about the double play now as he'll move up to second here on the wild pitch. Batting third. Digging in, Taylor Trammell. And he's got that batting lineup near the 300 mark entering play. Line toward right center. He leaps, but he can't get it. It's down for extra bases. Abrams rounds third and is digging for the plate. And he's safe at the plate as they take the lead. That is four. The third baseman, Jason Vossler. Into the box, Jason Vossler. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. Sitting in a good spot right here. Two ball, one strike count is yet to see a fastball. Have to be sitting on one right here. And a swing and a miss. Does that look like self-defense there? It's two and two. Breaks his bat as this one's popped up. Throw gets him. Two down. Digging in, Webster Rivas has two hits in 11 trips for the series so far. Ready with the 1-1. One -one. With runners in scoring position this season, Rivas has an eye-grabbing batting line, one that resides above the 340 plateau. You want to talk about having a career season, Matty. This guy's batting average is through the roof, one of the best in the business, and maybe more importantly, his OPS is through the roof as well, which means he's doing it with damage. The 2-2 pitch. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Williamson's under it. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. Coming to the plate now, Andrew Stevenson. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Now the one and one pitch. There's going to be a drag bunt. He gets it down. And the throw will be too late, so it's a bunt single to get him started here. Stepping in now, Cole Freeman. And that misses two and one. Stevenson on at first, nobody out. Hit in the air down the left field line. Left fielder giving chase. He's there and records the first down. Here's the catcher, Wellington Castillo. Runners on first with one down. Castillo. Takes this the other way to right. And that's in there. Base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Batting four. Not shortstop. Louis. At the plate now, Luis Garcia. This one's hit deep out to left center field. And, oh, he missed a home run by a matter of feet. It's off the wall. 
batting fifth. The right fielder, Keller. Keller. In now, Alec Keller tries to go the other way as this is in the air to left field. Trammell has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. Striding into the box, Aldrim Corridor. He's been held in check in the series, just one for 12 coming in. Here's the 1-1. One, one. And this ball runs away for ball two. Two and one. His pitch count is getting up there in the inning now. He needs to get this frame over with sooner than later, so forcing contact and getting the defense involved is probably the best thing he can do. He sent the 3-1. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. Almonte is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. At the plate, Brad Zunica. He drove in one of his team's two runs in yesterday's game. From the windup, the 1-1 pitch. Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with the bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty. But, hey, I give him credit. He's really working the count right here. Hit on the ground toward the left. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. Stepping up now, Abraham Almonte. Two hits and 13 at-bats in the series so far. The 1-1. Chopped up the line to first, but this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. Now here it comes. He might have to look for a different way to put this guy away on two two. He's already seen the curveball a couple of times, so he might be looking for it. And he holds off on the breaking ball, so the count runs full. Looked to me like he tried to do way too much on that 2-2 pitch. Nope. You don't have to come into the zone on that count, but a pitch that far outside isn't going to tempt anyone to swing. Stepping into the box, Michael Geddes. He's hitless in the series so far. Runner goes per second. Got him swinging the throw. It skips in and he's safe. Close play, but he's in there. Coming to the plate now, Ronald Bolaños. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right. And that'll move the count to one and two now. drive base hit to left field the throw home and not in time as the run scores now batting what the DJ Abram standing in now CJ Abrams just inside not by much it's two and two and he popped him up over toward the left side of the infield. Mapes is there to make the catch, and the side is retired. <laughs> Leading off the inning, Mac Williamson, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. <laughs> Swing and a miss as he pulled the string on him, one and two. Offered at that breaking ball below the zone, and that's a tough one to spit on. But the key is recognizing it coming out of the pitcher's hand earlier and making sure that it goes up before it comes down. More likely to be a hanger when that's the case. Popped him up. Vossler has room in foul territory. He's got it one away. Standing in, Jake Nolan. There's three hits in 15 tries for the series for him so far. The one two. And this is pulled hard, but foul. They brought their gloves for that one out there. This is on the ground over to first. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. 
Stepping up to the plate, Tyler Makers. Bases are empty here with two men out. Grounded to short. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Standing in, Bravik Valera. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Line shot to first, and there's one away. Now, now at the play, Taylor oh, Trammell. It was an RBI triple for him in his first at bat. Yeah, guys, that was the first triple of the year for him, and you got to believe it's not going to be his last. But wait. Now he goes the other way, and he got a lot of it high and deep to left center field. Meanwhile here, this is going to be trouble out there in left center, as it ought to be good for extra bases. Now that is first base, Jason Buffler. Now a spin and a throw back to second, and a dive, but he's back. In and another throw back to second and he'll dive back in safely into the box now Jason Bossler and a curveball here good pitch but a better take and it's to two and one now lifted down the line and left but this will land untouched Here now the 2-2. Swing and a liner. A leap, but he can't bring it down. Base hit. Tack on another here as the runner scores from second. Now that Webster Riva. At the plate, Webster Rivas. And this one runs a little too far in. Ball two. You can really tell about how effective this guy's going to be when guys are swinging at that changeup. So far in this one, they've been real smart to let it go. Three and one to him now. Halfway to 100 pitches, here it is. I think it's a real possibility that they put that run on first in motion. That would help them stay out of that double play that would end the inning, but that's also kind of risky at the same time. Oh, it's hit to third. Five, four, three. It's a double play, and the inning is over. Ready now, Andrew Stevenson, as we move on to the bottom of inning number three. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. Even count, two balls and two strikes. Neither guy willing to give in, and the ad battle continue. Here's another 2-2. Two -two. Hops this one up. Vossler into shallow left. He gets there to make the play for the first out of the inning. So striding forward now, Cole Freeman. He flew out in his last at bat. Third inning here, three to one our score. Here's a cold strike on the curveball, one and two. Hey, I don't mind that take right there. That was a nasty breaking ball. Started outside the zone, popped back inside. Belted high in the air out to left. A ball that's carrying. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Digging in, Wellington Castillo, one for one after a single this first time up. Yeah, guys, everyone knows he's been slumping. Dan, you can certainly attest to this, only amassing a solid one hit in your entire career. But pressure's off now. Maybe he gets hot. This is a good at bat so far here with two away. If you're going to go down one, two, three, at least make the guy work for it. He's doing that, and he's even gotten himself into a good hitter's count now. Runner on first with two away. On a line, that's a base hit. Now 
Now back, right fielder, Alec Keller. To the plate now, Alec Keller. And did he go around? No, he did not. Ball two. A time to start making some quality pitches. He finds himself in a tough spot behind an account with guys on base. Takes that one a little bit low. Three balls and a strike now. Pulled toward right center field. Long run for the right fielder. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Digging in for his second at bat, Brad Zunica. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. The 2 1. There's a fastball taken high for a ball. And it's fouled away. Swing and a miss as he ran the fastball right by him for the first down. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And that'll bring up Abraham Almonte to hit next. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. High in the air and drifting out to shallow center. Stevenson comes on now and makes the catch in shallow center for round number two. Striding in, Michael Geddes. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. And he takes a big swing at that one as this one's lifted high in the air and deep out to left field. Gone! This is just one of those parks where the ball seems to jump off the bat a lot more during the day. This is the first one of the day, but we might see a few more before this one's over. At the plate now, Ronald Bolaños. Fastball called strike, one and two. This is line to left. And that's in for his second hit of the afternoon. So good work on a one and two count to get on base. Now batting. So now to the plate, C.J. Abrams. Now the fastball is swung on and missed. And that misses two and two. Two out with the man at first. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. Now to the plate, Aldrim Corridor. He sets to lead us off in the home half of the fourth inning. lay off the curveball that's in the dirt that time and it's back to even now at two and two and good patience to hold back on the curveball in the dirt it's full now three and two wow from 0 and two to three and two and that last pitch on two and two wasn't even close he had this guy in the ropes but now he let him right back into this at bat Stepping into the box, Mac Williamson, 0 for 1 after a pop out in foul territory his first time through. Yeah, Matt, he's got to make an adjustment right here. His swing definitely broke down, dropped his back shoulder, and thus the result was a terrible pop up foul. The 2 2. score as we play inning number four. Boy, really making him work now as the seventh pitch of the at-bat is also fouled away, so the count will hold steady at three balls and two strikes. 
And he lays off there, ball four. So back to back walks have him in business here with nobody out. How about it? From now with the plate, Jake Knoll. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Yeah, Matty, expect this pitcher to try and get the same result. That's his last at bat right here. The double play is in order. Anything on the ground, the way this defense is, they could certainly roll too. The 3 1. And that misses. Ball four. And he's going to need to settle down in a hurry now because he's in a peck of trouble. Trace Barrera will get a chance to really deliver off the bench here as he'll pinch it, but the base is loaded and nobody out. On the ground is short. This could be two. He's got it. There's one. And it's in time to get him. But they do play to run on the play. Now back to the top of the lineup. Stepping in, Andrew Stevenson. Runner in scoring position with Sugan. Liner toward right center. And that'll get down out there near the wall. They'll cash in here as the run is in to score from third. It's now a 4-3 ball game. The batter number 15. Second baseman, Cole Freeman. Standing in now, Cole Freeman. Line drive to center field. And a dive, but it rattles in and out of the glove. Throw into second. The tag, and he's out going for second. That'll end the inning, but they do score one on the play. Austin Williams, the right-handed reliever, standing 6-3, gets the ball now out of the bullpen. Number 53. Into the box, Bravik Valera. Just hung in there on that one. No offer at the curve that time, and it's knotted up at 2-2. Two and two. Get to short. Fielded cleanly. And the fifth oh. inning will start with a ground out. One away. Trying to pick now things back. up where he left Let's off. Hit. Taylor Trammell. Taylor. He'll try to follow Trammell. up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Here now the 2-2. Hot shot down the line. That's popped up. But this will land untouched. Another one sent foul. Lifted down the line and left. And this will wind up a foul ball. Ready with another 2-2. Fly ball to straightaway left. Williamson's under it. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Jason Bossler. He's working on a one-for-two game so far. Here's the one-and-one one delivery. Now it's driven the other way with some authority. Headed toward the foul pole. But that'll stay in the park as it's off the left field wall. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. Now back, Texas, Webster Rivas. Stepping in now, Webster Rivas. And he fouls this one off. Here's the one-two. High fly ball out to straightaway center. And he will get there to make the running play, and that will end the inning. Set now for the bottom of the fifth. Digging in now, Wellington Castillo. It was a walk in his last trip. Here now the 2-2. Left center, base hit. Garcia. Eight. 
in there, two and two. Well, he snapped that breaking ball off really nice. He'll do well to keep putting it there. Hard hit ball to second. Oh, what a stop to second for one. Just late. He's safe. And the relay won't nearly be in time as he's there easily. Alec Keller will be the first to greet him here as he'll stand in with a runner at first and one away. The 1-1 one -one home. Lined into right, a base hit. And this one bounds around against the wall. Garcia is on his way home. And the run will score all the way from first. Into the box now. Aldrin Corridor. In there for a called strike. Three and two now. High in the air out to center field. Geddes is there. Two gone. And no tag at second. He'll head back there with two away now. And the versatile Mac Williamson hits next. Looking to keep this a one run game, the pitch. And this one runs a little too far in, ball two. A shot down the first baseline. And a reach, but it's by him as he couldn't quite get to that ball. The runner from second crosses the plate. Now batting. At the plate, Jake Knoll. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. This one misses, and that'll fill the count here. Three and two with two away. Good running count right here. Three balls, two strikes, two outs, run run first. He'll be off to the races on this pitch. And a good at bat that time as he lays off for ball four. And as a result, that'll move a runner up into scoring position now with two away. Two men are on with two men out. Fastball taken inside for a ball. Two and one now. Now a check swing, but he does manage to hold up in time. Ball three. I love the ability to hold up right there, especially with count leverage. I know you want to get aggressive in the strike zone, but he was able to notice that that wasn't his pitch. Now the three and two pitch. But a good play by the first baseman to spear this one, and that'll retire the side. Fernando Abad takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. Number 58, Fernando. New inning set to get underway. Settling in now, Brad Zunica. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. The 2-1 home. Swing and a liner. But this will be taken in out there at short, and that's the first out of the inning. Digging in the switch hitter, Abraham Almonte. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. The 1-1. is looked at for ball number two. Abad has seen his role change with those one batter lefty specialists going the way of the dodo as a part of MLB's pace of play initiatives. Three and one to him now. Hit in the air down the right field line. But this is just going to wind up being a foul ball. Got him looking with the fastball as that had some two-seam movement to it. Two gone. Now at the plate, Michael Geddes. It was a solo Michael shot for him in his last at-bat. Fouled off. Seventh pitch of the at-bat coming up. High in the air down the right field line. But this is just going to wind up being a foul ball. 
And this one misses inside a ball. He walked him, and they've got themselves a two-out base runner. Ray Patrick Ditter will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Ray Patrick Ditter. Lofted in the air out toward right center. And as it turns out, the two-out walk doesn't come around to haunt him as that ends the inning. Michel Baez enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 49, Michel. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. So the lineup flips over and digging in, Andrew Stevenson, hoping to build off that RBI double from his last plate appearance. Yeah, he did a great job to go down and get that one his last at bat. But I got to think they're going to pitch him up, maybe elevate something in the zone. Interested to see how he approaches this next A-B. Stepping in, Cole Freeman. He was thrown out at second trying to stretch a base hit into a double in his last at bat. Yeah, Matty, his wheels got him in trouble a little bit last time. Tried to take advantage, thought the defense was napping a little bit. In retrospect, maybe he should have just shut it down and steal second base. And that's the second out. So digging in now, Wellington Castillo. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. Full count here. Here comes the pitch. And that one's taken outside for a ball. They walked him. So no one, two, three inning here. They've got themselves a two out base runner. Shortstop. Luis Garcia. Out of play off to the right. A runner on first with two away. Hard liner, but picked up on a hop. On to second for the force out, and the side is retired. Aaron Barrett is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 32, All set for the start of the inning. Now at the plate, C.J. Abrams. He was sat down on strikes in his last at-bat. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see. And hold on now. That's a fair ball down the left field line. Should be at least a double. And he is in the second as he kicks off the seventh with a leadoff double. The battle. The second baseman. Bravic Valera. So now to the plate. Bravic Valera. There's a drive out toward the gap in left center. He pulls into second safely as they also push across a score to make now it a one-run game. Taylor Trammell. Standing in now, Taylor Trammell. Too high there and maybe a bit outside as well. Two and one. Unable to get the bat around in time and the count evens at two and two. him up no has a play and he hauls it in for the first out of the inning so coming to the plate Jason Bossler as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield hard liner to center field catch made out there in center field as the runner will tag from second and he's up to third safely now with two gone in the inning. So stepping in, Webster Rivas, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. This pitch is popped up. Casilla is under it. He's got it to end the inning as they'll strand the tying run in scoring position. In now, Alec Keller. He's working on a one for three thus far. Nope. Down low, two balls and a strike. In front of the changeup, and he can't keep it fair. Two strikes on him now. Here now the 2-2. Is looked at, and the count moves full. 
And just when you needed a shutdown inning, a leadoff walk was certainly not on the agenda. He needs a bear down right here. Into the corner and slicing foul. The next 3-2. Is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. Riding in once again, Aldrin Corridor. 0 for 2 for him to this point. Here's the 1-1 one one pitch. Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. And this one misses as well, and that pushes it to 3-1. and one. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. Now the three and two pitch. And this misses here for ball four. Just the second walk he's issued here into his seventh inning of work. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Mac Williamson. He enters this at bat one for two with a walk. Now a curveball is in there. One and two now. Fouled away. Again, a one-two. So you'd love for him to offer at that one, but the execution was flawless. Nice curveball that starts in the zone and breaks just out. Just a great take by the batter. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time, out number two. Ready for now another back. chance? Jake Noel. He's 0 for 1 thus far. No. The 1 2. And this one's in the dirt, but it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way to third. And that will conclude matters here in the seventh. Sam Freeman will come on to pitch now as he'll move into the eighth spot in the lineup on the double switch here. Adrian Sanchez is into the ball game as well as he'll slide into the pitcher's spot, hitting ninth now on the double switch. Now the one and one pitch. Now a ball fouled down the right field line out of play, so that'll move the count to two and two now. And the pitch. A full count, three balls and two strikes. And he lays off ball four. So now the potential tying run here is aboard late in the game. Now about it. At the plate, Abraham Almonte, 0 for 2 here to start the afternoon. And he misses low here, so the count goes to 3 and 1. This situation right here reminds me of sitting on the bench talking to John Smoltz, Hall of Famer. He would always say, even though the situation looked bad. Meanwhile, this ball is into right center, and that ought to be good enough for extra bases. Here comes the tying run home. And he's safe at the plate. We're all square at 6-6. Now batting. The at the plate now, Michael Geddes. Swing and a miss got him reaching. And the throw is there to record the first down. Ty France will come on to pinch hit here in a big spot. Number 11, Ty France. Go ahead runs in scoring position here with one away. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Hit well down the left field line, but back into the crowd foul. Hit down the line at first. And he'll take this one to the bag for the out. But meanwhile, the runner will move up 90 feet to third base. Now at the plate, C.J. Abrams. He's two for four in the ball game. C.J. Abrams. The 2-1 pitch. 
Pulled high in the air out to right field. Right fielder is on the run, and he brings it down to end the inning as the go-ahead run is left stranded. Jake Cronenworth is on the pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Stepping in, Adrian Sanchez. And he's getting his first plate appearance here in the eighth after entering off the bench just a little bit ago. The 1-1. One, one. And he popped him up. Abrams shading to his right. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Ready for another shot now. Andrew Stevenson. He's doubled and singled in four at-bats in this contest. Now the 2-1. Cole Freeman is on deck. Now the 3-2 and two pitch in the air out to straightaway left. Left fielder giving chase. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. The batter number 15. Digging in once second again, base Cole base. Freeman. Goal. He's one for four for the game. Freeman. Hit hard but foul toward first, so he'll come back and line it up again. He set the payoff pitch. Now a fastball as he just reared up and let that one fly, and the inning is over. Wait, Kyle seven. Finnegan will be on the mound to start the ninth inning, and his job will be keeping the ball game tied until the bottom half. Brevik Valera will be the first one to greet him here as he'll be forced to turn around and hit from the left side now. The 1-1 one -one home is taken nope. for ball two. Two ball, one strike. Inside for a ball as he falls behind to him here. Three and one. Line toward right center. Stevenson is to his left as he puts it away in the alley for the first out of the inning. Digging in to try it again. Taylor Trammell. In his last at bat, he popped out in foul ground. Yeah, this one's going to upset him for a little bit. You make the pitcher work the way he did right there, and that's the end result. That one sticks with you for a while. Saw his eyes light up that time, but he swung at a bad one there. And it's fouled away. One out, nobody on. In tight with the slider, two and two. Now a fastball inside, and he works it back to a full count now. And he lays off, ball four. Now the potential go-ahead run is on base here. So now it'll be the four-hole hitter, Jason Bossler. It's one away. The runner at first represents the potential go-ahead score. Double play is in order, however. Scooped up. The second for one. Back to first. A double play. And we stay tied heading to the bottom of the ninth. Into the box now. Wellington Castillo. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. There's a fastball well off the plate inside. And he just misses inside with the fastball there. Luis Garcia is on deck. The 3 1. Count full, three balls and two strikes. Mine to the right side. And it's a base hit. So there you go. The potential winning run aboard to start off the home half of the night. 
Into the box, Luis Garcia. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. All even now, two and two. Possible winning run aboard here, nobody out. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Ready once again, Alec Keller. He's got a chance to end this one and send these fans home happy if he can get a ball deep enough into the gap. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Now the one and two pitch. And he fouls this one off. Possible winning run on first, one man away. Fastball, strike three called as he couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. Now batter. Into the box play. now. Aldrin Corridor. No hits to this point. The set and the 1-1. One -one. There's a swing and a ball lifted to left, but back in the seats out of play. It's one and two. A ball and two strikes. Just a bit low. Tough call, but it's two and two. Threatened the zone. It's gone full now to three and two. Three, two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. Line hard toward right center. Almonte is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Into the box, Webster Rivas. In his last at bat, he popped out in foul ground. Yeah, Matty, and I think that pop out was just a result of poor pitch selection. Got to see the pitch over the heart of the plate. He chased well out of the zone. Oh, and this is hit high and deep out to left. And that is off the wall. Now batting the first base. Brad Zunica. To the plate now, Brad Zunica. And he misses with it, ball four. So the potential go-ahead run moves into scoring position now. So it's first and second now. Nobody out. And that'll bring up Abraham Almonte to hit next. Shows bun here, but this one misses, ball three. Yeah, now you've got a guy up there trying to give you an out by bunning. So the last thing you want to do is waste pitches and maybe put yourself in a situation. And that is down for extra bases. Is that on a plate to go ahead run and maybe another? Javi Guerra has given the ball here to try to work out of a tough situation. Two runners in scoring position to deal with. Your attention, please. Be changing defensively. Now pitching and batting in now, Michael Geddes. Here's a looping fly ball out to right. And he has delivered one of the biggest at-bats of the afternoon as he cashes in with a base hit. And this will not be close, and the run will score easily. Gordon Beckham will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Gordon Beckham. Side two and one. Three runs already home here. Fastball well outside. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Long run for the center fielder. He makes the catch. A great effort to get there and record the first out of the inning. So striding in, C.J. Abrams. He's looking for his third hit of the ball game here. Two and one. Runners on the move for second to first. And he'll take this over to the bag for the out. But meanwhile, the runner moves into scoring position at second. Batter now batting, Bravik Valera. Hit the ball pretty well in his last at-bat, but it resulted in a line-out. The 3-1. Pulls this one into the air, out into right field. Chuck will reach out with one hand to make the catch on the move, and that ends the inning.
Kyle Bearclaw enters the game here an inning later than usual as he'll try to close this one out in the 10th. Ready for the bottom of the 10th here. Digging in, Mac Williamson. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. A 1-1 home. Big sweeping breaking ball right there. Good pitch. But if he wants to get him to swing at it, he'll have to bring it in a little bit closer to the strike zone. Ball three. If you're at the plate in this situation, you're only thinking one thing, and that is get on base. You got three balls. It has to be perfect over those 17 inches for you to pull a trigger. A walk is as good as a knock right here. Now batting. Now in the box, J.B. Shuck. And he comes in as a player to watch out for, hitting well over 300 on the season. Right there at the belt, one and two now. Wow, I can't believe the hitter took that one. The pitcher absolutely got away with a hanger. Looked like the fastball got away from him there. It's ball two. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first out. Coming to the plate now, Adrian Sanchez. Flyed out in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. Now a swing and a ball popped in the air back behind short. Abrams ranges back and he has it for route number two. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Andrew Stevenson. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Right side. A diving try, but he can't haul it in. It's through for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Now back, second baseman. Goal. Into the box Goal now, back. Freeman. And a ball popped foul to the right side, out of play. Has them down to their final strike. Here it comes. And that pitch misses for ball four. So some intrigue now as the bases are loaded here with two away. Oh, they have him looking awfully confused up there right now. It's one and two. Hey, I love the aggressiveness right here and wanting to be a hero. But this is where you got to tell yourself to relax a little bit. Throw on to second for the force, and the ball game is over. Hey, it took them an extra frame to do it, but hey, they're not going to complain as they lock up a nice road victory here in 10 innings. 9-6, to six, the final tally in this one. Jake Cronenworth claims the win out of the pen, his first. Kyle Bearclaw closes the door for the save, his 15th of the campaign. So that just about does it. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way on over to theshownation.com. For the Chihuahua, nine runs, 14 hits. No errors, they left 10 men on base. For the Grizzlies, six runs, 11 hits. No errors, they left 13 men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 39 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this afternoon. And we remind you to please drive home safely.